Dan. And I'm Austin. We are here to play games. As a puppet. Yes, indeed. Welcome back to Lies of P, uh, episode six. And mm -hmm. We're just going to jump right back in here. I think, um, yeah, I'm back in the hub area here, but we're going to pop over to... I don't think we have anything to do here. Not yet. Oh, yeah, okay. Look, wish stone, all that. We're getting more stuff, but we're going to head back to the cathedral. Yep. Oh, right now, lying. Why are you always lying? Gotta lie. You're always lying around. We <laughs> you get up and go do some jobs. Do a gerb. Let's do see. a gerb. Oh, this is over here. Okay. Hello. So we are in Cathedral. Gold coin trees are Chapel. said to blossom when plague stalks the land. P -p Perhaps they've already bloomed somewhere in Krat. Hmm. Yes, yeah, guy. We must find gold coins. I guess he moved over here, huh? Yeah, he does. Yeah. Okay. I did some weird shenanigans in here, and there was a. Uh, a dude that went slithering down mm. before in the last episode, which I remember giving me a fair amount of consternation and dread. Yeah. What is that guy? All right, no jumping. Okay. This, what do you think this is? Elden Ring? Uh, I guess we got to go down. Mm -hmm. There's falling stuff mm. there. Can't even remember five minutes ago. Okay, so <laughs> we've slept since then. Get out of here. Uh huh. Oh. What is? Okay, maybe that's just there to be there. Yeah, this place is a little spooky. A little bit. <clears throat> it's one of the ways you can do a cathedral in a game like this. Really weird, creepy. Ooh, I wonder how deep the water gets. Decay! Oh no! It's decay water. Oh right, because I freaking fell off down here. I, I remember this now. <laughs> I am very smart uh, person. Okay. Um. There's an item over there. Could it be a trap? Cat dust. Ooh, they're mad. Oh, they are. These are such weird creatures, too. Yeah, they are. Nice. Get out of here. Now, what is cat dust? Uh, it's uh, the dandruff that comes off a of cat's fur. Uh, 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 let's see. Not an acid canister. Oh, is that it? Okay. Yeah. Oh, all right, all right. I want you to be sneaky. Yeah. Who wants to be sneaky? Cats. What? What? Okay. There's not a lot going on down here, but there's. Oh man, I'm a little on edge in this place. I gotta be honest. Oh, hey. <laughs> Excuse me. Whoa. Oh, my God. Oh, oh. <laughs> I made him mad. <laughs> I did not know that saw blades would do that. Yeah, I didn't either. I guess I it, expect, it, I expect it to be a one hit and then be done. Yeah, that's what I thought it was. All right. Well, learn something new today. Yep, that's a ninja star that keeps going. It's the ninja star that keeps on giving. That's right. Mm. Oh, that's nice. Uh huh. Oh, they're literally throwing their intestines or something at you. Yeah. 
Okay. Wow, that is a really strong item. Yeah, I like these. I'm gonna not waste the last one here. Let's see if I can get over to him. Nice. Good. You're gross. Hey, hey, madam. Not to mince words, but you're gross. <laughs> Eh. Oh, there's another one of those weird dudes against the... That's what we saw against the wall earlier. Yeah, yeah. Hmm. I guess those are... Um, that's weird. Uh, I guess those are more products of the... What were they talking about? It was... Um, uh, well, we thought it was the petrification disease, but I don't know that that's true. Maybe... Um, Something to do with the ergo, like a corruption of ergo in the body. Hmm. Because what was it? The the guy who does the cure all, or whatever, who had the magic cure for the the petrification disease, allegedly. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Might have been able to. Oh, hold on. Look across. Are we what? Looks like a gate or something you can open directly across where that item is. Uh, okay. I, I mean, you might be able to make it across. I don't know. There's just no way to jump. So. Yeah. All right. I am will just taunt me for the moment. We can always come back for it. Yep. Oh, hey. There's drop downs. Look like. Aha. Uh -huh. Damn it. Oh. Sadness. Oh, hey. Yep. Okay. Get this. Radiant Ergo Fragment. Okay. Hidden Moonstone. Cool. Can, can you open that side? Probably not. Nope. Don't look like it. I don't see a lever or anything. Okay. Uh, I guess I gotta go over here. Oh, well, all right. Down here, that's Ooh. what I meant. That's exactly that, what I meant. That ah. was a lot of damage. Let me out. Let me out. All right. Yes, I've taken that fall damage twice, and I'm not yeah. <laughs> that happy about that. <laughs> <laughs> that fall damage is pretty unforgiving. Yeah. Once again, you play Elden Ring long enough, you're like, oh, fall damage is a thing, right? Yeah, well, yeah, with Elden Ring, it's either you'll survive or you'll die, just about. Yeah. There's a very small window where you'll take damage from falling uh... and not die. Right. Oh. Cool. Good grief. These consumables are wild how strong they are. Yeah, they are. Oh. That, that, that is hazardous. It sure is. Hello. It's insidious the way they, they put that there. Yeah. <clears throat> All right. Oh, there's a thing down there, too. Uh, across, strictly across. There's like a person and oh. stuff over there, but hey. it doesn't look it doesn't look like there's a way to actually get across. Yeah, they can from just here. sit there and be angry, I guess. <laughs> uh, yep. Okay. Uh. <laughs> Don't uh. you like? Tiny platforms where you can get knocked off and hurt. Uh, he's throwing things. No. Mm -hmm. All right. Actually, uh, I was curious. Um, good grief. So back over here. Yeah. There's trees in his. Okay. All right. Just making sure I understand the area here. Okay. Yeah. Um, gears and stuff that doesn't look beneficial to drop onto. No, I can't imagine that it is. Angry people You're just gonna... behind me, and I've fallen oh. off. Oh. Oh. All right. Let's see if I can do that a little better. Well, <laughs> now you learned something, I guess. Don't walk into an obviously spinning thing that's going to throw you off. Yes. I've learned my lesson. Kind of. <laughs> Once again, viewers, you know what channel you're on. That's right. 
It is very curious, that whole thing, though. Yeah. It looks like, in theory, you can drop, but I'm guessing that's just death. <laughs> well, now's a good time to find it out. Nah, I got Ergo to get. It's fine. I'll be there when you get back. No, 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 no. <laughs> How dare you? Oh, right. I can... Forgetting my combat capabilities, I can puppet string some of these guys. Oh, yeah. Or pull yourself toward them, by the way. Gotta get back in the swing of things. Get it? I get it. The swing of things? Oh, you. Listen, oh. guys, your synchronized swinging. <laughs> <laughs> Go away. <laughs> oh, but they had such a lovely dance. I'm going to climb the ladder. You ready? Uh, uh, okay. <laughs> it check. Up, 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 mm. up, up. Okay. All right. I got rid of this shenanigans. Uh, what did you call me? Tried to block that. There we go. Oh boy. Oh. Nice. Better good, better good. Better nice. So the question is, how do I deal with that guy? I'm guessing you have to do the drop downs and he'll come up and be all, <laughs> Yeah, probably. <laughs> <laughs> Sounds like a whole lot of a not your problem right now. Pretty much. Okay, okay. The death or go back. Uh, yeah. no. Oh, 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 oh. That's a perilous platform, for sure. Biggest killer in Souls games, gravity. You know, that's probably true. I wonder, actually wonder what the genuine ratio of gravity deaths is to, like, enemy deaths. Yeah, I don't know. It's gotta be quite a bit, though. So. Quit throwing things. Nope. Oh. Okay. Wow, that is. That's a At least you damage. survived this time. Yeah. It just took a surprising amount of fall damage from that. I wonder if there's a better way to deal with this guy. Mm. I guess I could throw this. I don't want to hit the wheel again, though. Mmm. Mm. Alright. That worked. Good job. <laughs> I bounced off. It's very interesting that there is that particular interaction with like bigger blades. I don't think have does this drop down have anything on it? I don't think we've done this one, right? I don't know. Let's see. The answer appears to be no. I think it's just a safe way back down to the floor there. Yeah. Yep. Right, you safe are. Ish. What the? It's safer. Safer, Sephiroth? Yeah. Wait, there's no way Sephiroth is ever safer. Call that a Final Fantasy VII. <laughs> <laughs> Is he bizarro? 
Bizarro. Okay. So, a little bit of platforming shenanigans here. I am not the best at platforming, I must acknowledge. Mm. Okay. No, none of. Good grief. <laughs> yep. <laughs> we are forever locked into this room. So, uh, yeah, welcome to Liza P. Um, falling off edition. <laughs> We're just gonna fall off a couple more, just a few more times. Um, just to make sure I've mastered the art of falling off the platforms. Right, of course. Yeah. It's a skill like any other. Mm-hmm. You must maintain practice to achieve a certain degree of excellence. That's right. And this game clearly does not recognize your infinite skills. <laughs> yep. That's correct. I'm going to make it this time. I believe in you, Dan. I'm going to do it. You can do it. <laughs> I feel I feel cheated <laughs> and lied to. <clears throat> well, uh, we'll uh, we'll cut that part out. Uh, just you know, cut that. Um, that didn't happen. That's uh, <laughs> it's uh, lies. The, the lies of P. The, yes. li the lies of P are me, the game hacking and uh, uh, <laughs> lying to the viewers that I fell <laughs> off 115 times. We thought the rooftops were bad. Wait till you see rafters. <laughs> uh, Should call this the lies of D. What? <laughs> oh man. You know, it wouldn't be so bad if they quit cussing at you. There's murder! I don't know. It sounds like they're talking about your mom, man. I think you really need to put them in their place. Oh, I mean, I'm, I am killing them in one hit. I think they're pretty solidly in their place. Right. <laughs> and then you're getting shoved three stories down. That's, uh, that's details. Oh. <laughs> I'm gonna... Yeah, don't worry about that. Th those are irrelevant details. And they're lies. We've established right. this. They're lying right. about me. Who wants? Lies and slander. Scurrilous lies. This game is really earning its name. <laughs> oh my god. Alright. <laughs> Where? Okay, there it is. Now let's look around a little bit. Well, I didn't intend to do that. Whatever. Okay, that back there. That. I really want to know that gate over there. How to get to the other side of it. Hmm. Just curious. Well, let's keep going and we'll figure it out, I'm sure. Okay, here we go. Okay. So this ended up here. Oh. Okay. Do 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 do. See, really, um, this game's about the ladders. So, uh, I'm just kind of making sure, you know, they're of mm. good quality. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna mm -hmm. climb them up them enough times and they, you know, collapse on me. And I'm, I'm the ladder inspector for uh, the cathedral. Oh, is that what you are? Yeah. Perfect. Unless I'm lying, but that would be pre preposterous. 
Right, why would, why would you ever do that? That'd be silly. I would never lie. <laughs> Chris, everything I say is a lie, except that. Fascinating. Gotta say, I am not a big fan of that enemy placement. I get the yeah. challenge it's trying to do, but yeah, with the amount of falling off, it's just. Mm, I don't know, maybe I'm just bad at the game. <laughs> I won't say anything if you don't. Oh, wait. <laughs> Weird. What? <laughs> You got oh, it's because you also have to go through that too. Like, oh, yeah, like it's a bit of a gauntlet, right? Everybody watching this is like, well, obviously, well, listen, viewers, sometimes I look away while we're playing. I know it's terrible, but I do <laughs> sometimes. I'm looking at what's coming up next so I can help them at least look for items. Yes, this is true. Okay. Interesting. So this is... Awful? Yes. Wow. Oh, oh, there's a broken one, though. Okay. Well, that's not what I meant to do. Okay. Is it broken? Oh, I see. There's a couple... Yeah, there's a couple of broken sections. They give you a longer space to get through. Okay. Yeah, yeah. So it's not quite so bad. Actually, just uh, uh, there I go. Uh, oh my gosh! You know, I think if they didn't push you back so far every time, it wouldn't be quite as bad. Yeah. Okay. I wonder well, if there well, are any throwables I can buy somewhere. Do I have more throwables? Hold on. I feel like using throwables is the way, the best way for me to. You should have quite a few. Yeah. Uh, well, those are ampules. Yes. Um, yes. Uh, so there is that vendor in uh, the city hall area, I think, before you fought Murphy. You know how you would take an elevator. Right. There's that guy with like the wrappings. He sold, I think, consumable throwing, like fire bombs and stuff. But I don't, I don't know if he had a limited supply or not. Mm. There might be some in Hotel Crowd as well. Because you've got two vendors in there now. Or more than two, but... Okay. We'll be right back. I return. Do you, though? Yeah, sure, why not? Uh... Okay. That's fine. I'm curious, mm -hmm. as we're exploring options here, with your... Legion arm that we haven't really used much of mm -hmm. in this area. Can you pull them off the platform? Or are they too big, you think? I think the big dudes are too big to pull off the platform, but I can probably hook shot over to them, which I am going to try. So, uh, viewers, if you're yelling at the screen for me to do that, I'm going to give it a shot. <laughs> Seems like having a fire weapon might be good in this area. Yeah, maybe. Oh. He straight up to 90, that move. Yeah. Go. I'm not the biggest fan of the sprinting uppercut, but it's reasonably... It's got a reasonable tell to it, so it's fine. All right. Mm -mm -mm -mm. Come here. Let's see how well these do. Okay. It's about what I thought. Yeah, if you had gotten the second one off on him, probably would have taken him out. But. 
Interesting. Like while it's, help, while it's helpless still low. There you go. Those work out pretty nicely. Yeah, it seems like electric blitz doesn't do a huge amount to them, but they're, you know, it's still not bad. I mean, even if all it does is stun them for a minute so you can get to where you're trying to get to. Yep. You gotta make it all the way over there. Uh-huh. Hmm. Nope. All right. Oof. I don't know how much of that was because he hit you at the same time, or if it's because it, like, won't let you shoot across. Yeah, I don't know. I'm not sure which, which thing happened there. Let's we climb once again. Into the fray. Where there's no end. Giant annoying birds. Okay. Throwing out their guts. What? Giant throwing dudes. Or giant dudes throwing out their guts. Oh, yeah, yeah. That's true. But it won't be long before we stab them in the butts. A poor I asked him. Alright. Ooh, that is some good work. There you go. Good. good. Take that. Good, 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 good. On the plus side. This game does make you use your consumables, which is more than can be said for some Souls-like games. Yeah, it does seem to require the use of... Ooh, man. All right, let's see. You can do this. You got all the time in the world. Okay, so... Yeah, there you go. Star Fragment. Okay. Mm, 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 mm. Walking baby mode. Okay. <laughs> baby mode. Yep. <Yeah. clears throat> Is that? I don't know. Potential. I'm not gonna. Yeah. It's a little risky. Oh, hey, here's the other side of that uh, fence we were looking at earlier. I'm not oh. saying you should be able to go through it. But you can't. Still go through it, but, you know. What? Oh, yeah. Right. Yeah. Right. It doesn't look like it. These look like they should have hidden walls. Right. Oh, I don't like that. I was going to say, watch out. <laughs> I do not like that. Just screams trap. Uh-huh. A little bit of Sin's Fortress here. I'm not even sure how to deal with that. Well, the question is, does it take up the whole space or not? Yeah. It's a good question. I bet. I bet you can run on the right side, yeah. Yep, there you uh, go. I was very scared that was going to hit and kill me. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> oh. Oh my gosh. Woo. Making my nerves. That's a, that's an enemy. Pl the decisions were made there. Right. All right. You up? You know. I almost feel like you need like a smaller weapon for these tight spaces. You know, these enemies are not that threatening. They just make really aggressive sounds. Yeah, which is startling to say the least. Right. Okay, so yes, I am going to go to my fire weapon. I think Archbishop is dead. Those who are still alive must flee from the dead. Mm. Interesting. Uh huh. That's what I thought.
Mm. Certainly interesting ways of applying pressure. Yeah. But not like egregiously so? No, yeah, it's it's not that bad. I really hate the design of that enemy. Yeah, I can't stand it. Not because it's a bad design, but because it grotesques me out. <laughs> oh, well, I don't like big enemies that throw 800 million things at you, but... Oh, well, yeah, okay, yeah, like, mechanically it's annoying, too. Don't yeah. wrong. I'm, I'm just saying, like, it's not a bad design, specifically. Oh, hey, you can jump! Fascinating. I wonder if you could only do that, though, when you hit this point. I do not know. All right. So there was that. There was also the going up section I thought I saw earlier. I'm not. Well, this is that side. It's, Look, it's the same wheel. Yeah. Yeah, it is the same wheel. And there's okay. an item up there. Yeah. That, is that the only way up there? I don't know. It looks like it goes around that pole there, so we should we what? should be able to get that. There's a there's a, the pole along the wall. It looks like the the, the uh, pathway walks around oh, it. Oh yeah, yeah yeah yeah. Are you saying move on and we should be able to get it later? Because yes, I'm that's what I'm thinking. That direction, yeah. Okay. Okay. Here's, here comes your opportunity. Yep yep. Uh oh. Oh no. I made a mistake. Oh dear. Uh missed. Oh. There it goes. Oh. <laughs> All right, I'm going to switch my weapon. No. Oh. Stop throwing your innards. There. Bunch of blue buds. Sits on the freaking doorway where you dink off the side repeatedly. Right. Ugh. All right. We're going to make the jump this time. <laughs> we are not going to land on the cog. <laughs> oh. I did it. Sweat. All right. That's not, not the right useful. Way. Yep. There's a um, person right there. Uh, could go over there. I don't know what. Oh, that's above. Yeah, hold on. Interesting. Look up. Yep. Okay. That looks like you can get up there that way and then go over there. So if I go this way, I might be able to loop to push it. Push the burning kiln. Oh, push the kiln over to, over the ledge here. Oh, interesting. Take that. Ah, and that takes care of your decay problem. Fantastic. All right. There's supposed to be a lever somewhere that you can use to... There you go. <laughs> Is it over there? It might be. All right, let's, let's assess this. This is a far tighter... Although I could probably drop onto one of them. Yeah, and then walk across. Yeah, yeah. that's much safer. All right. Yeah, there's a ladder there. That's what I thought. Oh, there's the lever, too. To your right. Yeah. All right. Just pressed. Now, you can go across those things. Oh, and they'll go the right direction, so you got a shortcut back. Oh. All right. Oh. Yeah, because it's right down at the bottom where that Stargazer oh, is. Oh, that's cool. Okay. Yeah. All right. Good. That's, uh, it, good ingenuity for, like, wrapping things around. Yeah, I mean, yeah. Again, developers of this game clearly like Souls level design, which right. I, I appreciate. And there's that item that yep. we were contemplating jumping on the cog to get, so I'm glad we didn't do that. Yeah, it wasn't the right. It didn't feel right. <laughs> Interesting. I'm gonna go over there. <laughs> I have no interest in doing that right now. 
Yeah. Okay. This place is scary and I'm ready to move on. Hmm. It's boss time. This is a but not big boss. Vicious room. It's a midi boss. Mid boss. Mid boss. Oh, one of these. Great. It's a mutating carcass. Oh. Okay. I see you. Mm hmm. Good. What an interesting um, enemy. Yeah. But that shield that was kind of. Intriguing. Were those all spinning a second ago and they stopped as soon as you died? Uh, I don't think so. Okay. I'm just going crazy. I'm going crazy. Then there go fragment. All right. Okay. So... Should come across a chest here shortly. Really? Yeah. There it is. Give me. <clears throat> a crat supply box. Can't expand Poland. Oh! So we gotta bring that to Polandina. Yeah, it seems like it. Interesting. I assume that's not like a consumable. It's just yeah, like it's probably a under key item or something. Yeah, activate function. Functional items. Cool. What's this? Elevator. Elevator. Going up. Down. Nope, going down. Further down, we have to we'll go through to the, the planet core. <laughs> the planet core. <laughs> Oh man, it's crazy though. Like we we walked up on this cathedral and it's massive and it's got multiple layers up and we've only gone down. The library. Who's talking? Hello. Oh, there's a person. All right, hold on. Let me activate this. Yeah. Right. Ooh, we got some side activities. Side activities. Side activities. Hey, thermite, cool. The first will be for looking for our NPC friend. Oh, I think, uh... Hello. Hey. I'm surprised to see who's... well... alive. What? Oh, where are my manners? I'm Cecile, and I serve the Archbishop. I'm the only one left. Everyone's dead. From the petrification disease or from the monsters. I didn't die. But my heart breaks more each day. But I wish I had. Me a kindness. Bring me the holy mark from the Archbishop's quarters. Hmm. The Archbishop was a true saint. He was my savior. Huh. If I write his words into my heart, maybe it'll give me the strength to carry on. I can't die, but perhaps this can help me live again. Please, bring me the holy mark as quickly as you can. All right. Talk to her again. Side quest. I can't die, but perhaps okay. this can help me live again. Yeah, she said that. Okay. Yeah, got to exhaust that dialogue, though. Yep. Is that the archbishop? Maybe. Okay, we're gonna go back to the Cathedral Cat Chapel real quick. Okay. Because we cleared out that whole decay pool, right? Oh yeah, true. So there's um, there's some stuff in there to get. All right. 
Let me spin some of this ergo real quick, and I'll go there. Fine. Next. But we're going to Hook Hill Crat right after we grab this stuff. It's a great place to have a vacation. In the broken basement of this cathedral? Whoops. Yeah, of course. On a cloudy evening? Yeah. You got it. Yep. You got it. And go up that way. It's cool. That's a cool shortcut. There's Ooh. a whole lot of stairs down. Okay. Take them down. All right. Yeah, nothing oh, in this main section, right? Just go down the stairs. Yeah, wow. nothing. There's a fly All right. Take that. Go down here. With ya. Yeah. I hear anger. You gonna drop down behind me? Probably. Come on. <laughs> or okay. not. Maybe he's behind the door. Let me in. Let me in, let me in, let me in, let me in, let me in. Man, I guess this was just... Alright, so... Oh. Neat little area. Yeah. <laughs> Crafted cryptic vessel. Mm-hmm. Decode the cryptic vessel to obtain a hidden clue. Ooh. I like clues. Do you like blues clues? Yes. What about Hughes clues? I write blues clues in my handy dandy notebook. Oh boy. Oh man. And when you get enough, do you sit in your thinking chair? Of course. What else would one do? Yes, I <laughs> Cry? I don't know. Yeah. Uh. That's what I was doing okay. earlier. No more crying. Oh. oh, right. Crying, trying to get up here. All right, so the next thing we're going to do is take the shortcut platforms up. <laughs> That's scary, though. All right, let's go up. Um, and about halfway up, there should be, like, a small platform kind of off to your right-ish. Over there? A wall? Yeah, right, right here, I think. Oh. Right here. Oh, oh hey. Not a good spot. A little tucked away alcove here. Yep. That should be the Legion, Legion plug. plug. Yep. Craft Legion arms. Legion calibers to modify Legion arms. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. That's the upgrade material for Legion arm stuff. Yep. Or one of them, I guess. Um, yep. Okay. And then finally, we're going to go all the way up. All the way up. Okay. I'll wait for the next one. Okay. And then we're gonna hop on one of the, the large wheels to be taken to a secret room. Oh boy. Yeah, I think you noticed it when you were up in that up, upper area before. Get off there. Is that right? Or do I need to? Yep, nope, that was right. Okay. Secret wheel. The lo yeah, it's one of these large wheels, I, I guess. Maybe this one will take you to the secret room? I don't know. Curious about this secret room. Yeah, this looked like it was writable, so. That does explain everything. Oh, yeah, that's exactly where we wanted to go. Look at that. Huh. Handy. Alright. Or oh, not? That was scary. Oh, yeah, perfect. That's exactly what we wanted. Right there. Give me this. Lots of cool treasure in here. Yep. New item. <laughs> New weapon. Yeah, baby. I thought you'd like that. Blind man's double-sided spear. Well, that's interesting looking. Yeah, it is. Oh, oh. That is fast. Oh. Can... I see. double-sided because you also can smack him with the blade there it's the a, handle it's a technique weapon <laughs> mm. <laughs> I'm uh, liking my build choices currently yeah that's interesting I, I wonder probably uh, let's look at the abilities here okay quick stab, quick stab yeah. Lord. yeah payback stab okay that's After it. guarding an attack for more power. Ooh. Yeah, so that's left bumper Y, and then this one's just... Okay. Hm. All right, well, let's head back to Hotel Krat. 
Okay. Hotel Craft Cheese. Mm, I don't think taking those. Do you have? Whoa. Uh, hey. Do I have what? I was wondering if you have like a return to. Oh, I think so. Uh, oh yeah, you get the watch, right? Yeah. Hotel, yeah. Yeah, get that watch. Okay. Candy. Yeah, useful. <clears throat> All right, so we got a couple things to do here. We need to talk to Paulandina and okay. give him the crap supply box. And we gotta talk to Vanini to Welcome get that decipher. Hat shop goods. This is a supply box officially approved by the city of Krat. I shall open it and add it to the hotel shop. Many thanks, good sir. Very good. Got a very vivid ergo from right to hotel. Got a talk option about stalkers. The stalkers are Krat's vigilantes. There are two groups of them, the Bastards and the Sweepers. Oh. The Bastards are an organization of guards for the Alchemists and the Workshop. Hmm. Motto, honor or nothing. Interesting. The Sweepers are an organization of guards for the old families of Krat. Motto, we always repay what is owed. They always pay their debts. Historically, the relationship yeah. between <laughs> the two groups has been turbulent. But most were killed in the puppet's full-scale attack. That is what little I know beyond the hotel walls. Hmm. May I serve you in some other way? A little bit of lore there. <clears throat> yeah. I Welcome wonder if the uh, old lady has anything more to say. Yeah, we can talk with her. Ooh, he's got... Dark Moon. Okay. That's for your next tier of weapon upgrade. That's special weapons. Huh? Upgrades a special that... weapon blade up to plus three. Oh, okay. For some reason, I thought it was like your second level of moonstone. For no, some reason. no, that's the crescent moonstone. I've got a few. Right. Of those. There's an apple. Looks like bursting with sweet, refreshing juice. That's got to be particularly precious in crop these days. It's got to be important for something. Yeah, it's definitely a quest item. Mm -hmm. <laughs> if I ever saw one. Yeah, we got uh, he's got quartz, which is great for your pea organ. Oh, quartz, yeah. I feel like at least buying one of these right now is a good idea. I don't have enough for the other one. I could sell right. some of these the lower ones. Because that will give me the same amount as if I use them. Uh, and then... Still don't... Yeah, I don't have quite enough, so... That's all right. Um, Benini. Oh, all right. Oh, yeah, the old lady too. All yeah, right. I was just sorry. I don't know if she has anything else to say. Yeah, we'll she may out. have nothing. Hello. You have no idea so many secrets are buried in Krat. Thanks for keeping me company. What are you curious about? The uh, weird orange juice you've got on your chair. Look, she had a lot of screwdrivers in her youth, and so now she has to. Keep a good concentration in her bloodstream. I mean, it looks like chemo liquids, honestly. Or that. Something radioactive. But it could be screwdrivers. Who knows? I can. Okay, actually, I'm curious about this. Hold on. Craft Legion Arm. Okay. Okay, so these are some of the ones we had available to craft. We hadn't been able to craft them yet. Okay, all right. This, yeah. Okay, so these are Legion plugs. Interesting. So the Falcon Eyes. Yeah, that's the fire armor piercing shells. Mm hmm. Aegis. That one might be really good for situations, although. Block enemy attacks with left arm. Huh. Yeah, can make weapon attacks while guarding. Fable slot remains. Parry by pressing the Fable button. Charge. For, okay. Yeah. Pandemonium. That's acid. That's decay. 
Yeah. Just... Uh, yeah, Deus Ex Machina is the landmines. So, of these, I'm most inclined to go with the Aegis or maybe the Falcon Eyes. Those both look pretty good. Oh, yeah. Because of the ability to shoot distant weapons mm -hmm. with the Legion Arm, that would have been really helpful, say, in the area you are just at when you didn't have any throwing items. Right. Yeah, that's why I'm sort of inclined to go with the Falcon Eyes, even though I do like the Aegis. It's pretty cool. Right. Um, let's do the Falcon Eyes, I think. I think overall it's going to be more helpful for, for you at the moment, because you, you're pretty good at... Uh, Perfect garden. We'll do that one. New material gunpowder. Let's switch to it. Ah. That's pretty cool. It's a literal it's a literal hand cannon. I have a hand cannon. Sweet. Panini. Hmm. Isn't this uh, a cryptic vessel? <laughs> well, I would expect nothing less from you. It's pretty cryptic. What I mean, so. of course, is that this is a humble invention of mine. A cipher device. Humble Once your information is locked in here, only you can get it out. <laughs> of course, once people realize the value of a truly unbreakable way to keep secrets, knockoffs flood the market. The trials and travails of true genius. Forever copied, never credited. But, I admit, even some of these knockoffs could still hold secrets. You're welcome to take a crack at, uh, well, cracking it. <laughs> Who knows? It could lead you to something truly valuable. Or at least more practical. I don't know if it's because of the cuff of his coat or the angle in which he's holding his hand, but his hand feels small for his body. Hmm. Yeah, it, it, yeah, it's a little small. <laughs> Can we decipher this? Yeah. I'll May I be him. of assistance? I can decipher this in moments, if you'd allow me. Oh, sure. I admit I'm a bit rusty, but it's all starting to come back to me. Genius never sleeps and never truly abandons the truly brilliant. What? No, of course I didn't read the contents. Who has time to read anymore? <laughs> but uh, I could help you read it if you want to. Uh huh. Orders. Orders. Huh. Oh, I pressed the wrong button. There we go. Strike the puppet. Hanging, hanging from the Alchemist Bridge on Lysian Boulevard. Uh huh. Adelina. Uh huh. Dear Adelina, I prepared a shelter for you. It's an apartment on Elysian Boulevard. You can stay there until everything settles down. I've arranged for someone to take you there. Once you get to Alchemist Bridge on Elysian Boulevard, you're safe. What? The address and the key are hidden in the puppet hung from the Alchemist Bridge. Ask your escort man to strike the puppet. The shelter was supposed to be our first home, but I guess next time. To make up for that, what happened, I'm escorting the Alchemist for a bit. We're going to St. Frangelico Cathedral and all the way to the Grand Exhibition. Maybe the mission is to bring petrification disease cures to the refugees. I'll be back as soon as it's done. Okay. Very interesting. So if we go strike that, maybe it'll lead us to somewhere that has some stuff or something. Right. So we're actually going to go back to the Krat City Hall Stargazer and do that. Okay. Uh, I don't know if you want to look at weapons or upgrades or anything while I we're here. Kind of do, yeah. I know my way around. Yeah. I'm just saying that's the next thing is to go investigate the clue. Yeah, so Crescent Moonstones and then Dark Moon Moonstone of the Covenant could upgrade that. I'm going to save that, though. I am particularly interested in this weapon. This is pretty cool looking. Let's see something. Yeah, so I could give it the Fire Blade and it would be at a plus two. I would lose the quick stab, but I would get ignite, which is interesting. Let's try it. And I am gonna give the salamander blade an upgrade. Wow. Yeah. Okay. Cool. And then because that's my main weapon. I don't know, though, because there's Link Slash 
And then... What does this blade it came with have? Or no, it's this blade. Booster blade. Storm Slash. Rush forward quickly to Sash. Yeah, okay. I guess we'll stick with this combo. This is a pretty good combo right now, I think. Yeah, I think so. Ooh, I can get it to five. Let's do it. Yeah, see, these do require Crescent Moonstones. Yeah, they they require Crescent, not Dark Moon Moonstone of the Covenant. Which is what we just picked up. That That's what's used for these special weapons. Okay. I guess I was confused because we were looking at Crescent Moonstones. Maybe they have the same shape, and I don't know. They're, yeah, they're both <clears throat> in the shape of a crescent. See? Yeah, okay. Yeah, so I'm not going to upgrade because I haven't really been using this, but... Right. Uh, or the scaling... Oh, I have to, like, look at it elsewhere. Just curious. Yeah, it's a tech... Or it's... Yeah, okay. A little more motivity and some technique. I mean, it hits pretty hard. It's not a bad weapon, but I've just been doing very well with this. Right, yeah, I don't think there's any reason to change what you're comfortable with. Yeah, so... Yeah, and see, that raises it by five. What if I... Which, it wasn't noticeable before, though, right? What? The upgrade wasn't noticeable before, right? Oh, that's correct, yeah. Yeah, so... it, it was like nothing before, so... It is starting to do something, I just still don't see the use of it, I guess. Yeah. Well, because you're putting so many more points in technique, right? Yeah. Um, if you wanted to put more points into strength, you would do a motivity, which would change the motivity's scaling. Right. Yeah, that brings and, it more and, to, like, a quality weapon. Right. Which is going to give it a better output for that build, so... Yeah. I think it's just it's, it's helping you fine-tune. Mm-hmm. And uh, there's no reason to use them if we're not getting a good use out of them, I think. Yeah. Let me just leave it alone. Got it to plus five, though, so I think we're in good shape here. Link Slash yeah. is pretty good, even though I keep forgetting to use it. Um, is there anything else? Oh, hang on. Quartz. Geppetto. Gotta talk to the pet, man. Yeah, we can talk to Geppetto as well, but definitely want to use Quartz. Right. Geppetto. Got anything for me? Oh, it's up again. The city of Krat. It's probably not how you remember it, eh? Nah. Ask me any questions, and I'll fill in the gaps. Yeah, Nothing new. All, all right. All stuff of. Okay. All right. Let's see. All right. Okay. So, we've got three quartz available. Um. Which means you can fully upload one of these. Chain guard regain using pulse cells. Max number of pulse cell uses. Another amulet Ooh. slot is extremely tempting. Uh, okay. Let's do the amulet slot. Yeah, I think so. Alright, now I can go to these level 2 ones. Let's see. Durability is at max. Okay. Ambush stagger attack. Okay. Perfect guard destruction. Ooh. <laughs> That's pretty cool. Let's see. What do we got? Recovery effect of pulse cells. Yeah. Okay. That's upgraded healing. Let's see. Guard regain reduction. Okay. Damage received during charge attack when using interesting. Okay. Hmm. Lower consumption from dash is kind of nice too. Yeah. Increased consumable effect duration. Hmm. Oh, well, that's handy. Mm hmm. Enhances the effect of fable catalysts. Yeah, that's what recharges your fable, remember? Yeah. Yeah, okay. Um. Hmm. 
<laughs> what to do? Any thoughts here? Um, I think lower ergo loss is only going to help you in the long run. Mm, that's true. And while we're not dealing with it a lot right now, I'm sure the the dashing stamina will be helpful too. Okay. Yeah, and the other the other thing that looked cool was the perfect guard destruction. <laughs> yeah, that one's also I would say one of those three, personally. Yeah. I Maybe perfect guard over dash, but Yeah, I'm gonna do the perfect guard, but the dash one I think I'll grab as well. I can grab it from another one of these nodes here. Oh wait, right. This one. Oh no, no. Okay. Interesting. It's got that over there. All right. Uh, we could get another pulse cell. Retain guard regain. Do we have anything down here that? Time of enemy star. Okay, it's kind of nice. Oh yeah, the charge fable slots. Does this only allow? I could do those because I'm too level two. So yeah, I I think that was worth getting actually the fable slots. Yeah, I agree. Um, okay, and then that was stamina consumption from dash. All right. Yeah, and if I just had the ergo to get uh the other thing. Oh, you still have some consumables, right? I don't think I have any I can use. These are... Oh, gotcha. Those are boss ergo. A treasure hunter may want this rare ergo. We gotta find a treasure hunter. Maybe we'll exchange the ergo for, like, boss weapons and stuff, probably. Because he's got boss weapons! Boss weapons! Alright. I think we're good here. Uh, where are we going? Uh, we are going to Krat City Hall. Yes, good. Very good, very good. And we're going to go to the bridge where we fought the mad donkey. Donkey! donkey. Yep. Yep, yep. The yep. mad donkey. Or we fought video game donkey. Mm. Right there. Yes. Cool. And there's uh, the hanging puppet. Yep. I assume I have to use a throwable on it or something. Throwable? You might be able to fire at it with your legion arm as well, but... Let's try it. Oh. Cool. Aim better at it. Oh, that is some... Sensitive. There you go. Oh. Stuck and exploded Letter. too. Elysium Boulevard 221B. <clears throat> 221B Adelina. Baker Street. A key is enclosed. Okay. Hmm. All right. Now we got to figure out where that is. Yep. A letter with refugee's address. Okay. So inside the house on Elysium Boulevard is our next location. Okay. That's actually a stargazer we can go to. Okay. Do that next. Yep. We're going to walk across the small plank and check the door on the right before the first puppet enemy. Okay. I think I know where that is. All right. So we're right here. Yep. Do two one B. Do two one B. Excellent. Oh, there's a safe. Just rip the door off. I know, right? All doctors hunting of bra. Oh, quartz! Yeah! Let's take, <laughs> take a look at the apparel here. <laughs> oh! <laughs> Interesting. I don't hate that, though. Yeah. It might be time for a new headpiece, though. Yeah, um, let's see. Bandana. <laughs> yeah, it's kind of funny. Uh, 
shit. Let's see here. Um, top hat. Okay, hmm. girl, let's top hat. Could be the best of boys. Sure. That's not bad. <laughs> That's interesting. Oh, that looks kind of funny. Just go no hat too. Oh yeah, it does. There you go. Yep. You do that too. Some Floofy. option. Floofy hair. Yeah, he does. Alright, we got Can you go up the stairs or anything? In here. No. Okay. I mean, I can go up the stairs, but can't do much up here. Yeah, there's nothing up there, yeah. Okay. Alright, so uh, back to the cathedral library. Snazzy new coat. I like the long coats a little more, but this is interesting enough. Yeah, all right, we can go back to long coats, fine. Oh, actually, use your quartz before we go back. Yes. Now we gotta figure out what our next ability will be. Me? Oh, that's literally just, okay. Sprinting, 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 sprinting. It's kind of a military isque outfit. Yeah. Yeah, it's like a officer's coat a little bit. Yeah. There we go. Level up. Level up. Activate level the Porgon. Let's oh, see. Oh. Uh, Porgons, God, it's such that's such a terrible. I know I said it last time too, but that's terrible. Porgons. <sighs> uh, <laughs> uh, Can't do green. Mm, you already got a green. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Attribute resistance always good. Is there one status ailments? Hmm? Is there one that like lowers fall damage? <laughs> I don't know. Maybe. I didn't see one going through here. There's charge attack. A oh. pulse recovery would be good too, actually. Yeah, let's do that. It's a good general use one. Yep. Phase three is open. Awesome. Yeah, so oh, this requires three. Let's see. I'm just curious what we got up here. Condensed Legion Arm attack. More than half of the. Okay. Another Maybe perfect guard stage. destruction enhancement. Yeah. Charge stagger attack to. Goes up to five. Alright. Special resistance. Um, okay. Full cells. Guard regain reduction. Damage when discharged. Okay. Hmm. Use wish stones quickly. Ooh. Which we haven't really used wish stones yet, right? Uh, not really, no. Hmm. Charge fable when I don't remember what wish stones do. I don't either. Uh, charge fable when reviving. That's nice. Naturally recovers durability of inactive. Okay, cool. Some cool abilities in here. Reduce item. <laughs> Handy. handy though. Yeah. Uh, Legion magazine effect enhanced to. Okay. Maximum amount of gold coin fruit on the gold coin tree. Mm. Whatever that is. We haven't found it yet, but that one guy was talking about it. Mm. Increase ergo upon eliminating. Yeah. Okay. So exp boost. Yeah. Hmm. Those Interest. are all good. Yeah. There's phase five that requires four to activate any of these. So that's okay. Yeah. And it's pretty cool. More stuff. I got four bars now. Uh, I could jump. It's literally the Dark Souls jump. Good grief. All right. Uh, where am I going again? Cathedral Library. Oh, uh, the library. Yes. Yeah. Does anybody need an apple?
in a pool. <laughs> a pool? Would you like to buy a pool? Yes. Alrighty. So now to move forward with our plans here. Hmm. Anyway. Yep. Um, I assume we gotta yeah. find the bishop for her. Yeah, well, giving what she wants will get us to the final boss, was what it looks like, so don't worry about her request specifically too much yet. Okay. Uh, watch out for pressure plates. Oh boy. Yeah. Anything down here? Okay, probably gonna well. have to, probably gonna have to, like, um, burn this water like we did last time. Just throw a guess. candle in there. <laughs> oh, you're right. Appears to be only one way to go here, so all right. Thought what did I just say? I thought hugging the wall would do that. Nope. <laughs> oh. oh. Oh no. no. Do not like. Oh. Oh, okay, I thought there was an actual like slime monster and not just a trap, but just a slime trap. Oh I don't hey, like you know, that placement. Let's see. You know you know what's great? That. Great time to test that. <laughs> <clears throat> Phew. Oh. Oh, because I didn't hold it, it like detonates after a second. Interesting. That is interesting. I just realized there's holes in the floor. Yeah, well, actually, we want to go down one of them. Yeah. Okay. Do that before moving. There's an item right there. Yeah, there's, we're going to pick up a Legion Caliber from that chest down there. Right, just grab that. That hurt. Oh, are we? Excellent. Ah, yep. ah, ah. What, uh, yeah, watch out for the... Ooh! Moody fly! That one's pink. Advanced crank. Ooh. Cool. Handy. Drop down. All right. Yeah, so now we're going to continue uh, on. However we get back up or whatever. Yeah, I assume I got to make my way back up. <laughs> Stop with all the... <laughs> Listen. Let's see. Place is cursed is the abyss of hell. You cannot leave. The only thing waiting for you is despair. Is despair of bananas. What? It's a pear. <laughs> it's despair. I, I got it. Or maybe it's despair call instead it of the an apple. Arm of God, you arrogant one. You've called the, the wrath of God upon yourselves. Okay. I don't think that's what that blood says. I'm just saying. Yeah. That graffiti looks a lot different than what it says it says. Keep using that word. What does that actually say? I, it says something. <laughs> Some, something's the best cook. Huggins. Huggins. This is the door I just tried to open a second ago. Sure is. Great. All right. Now we can move on. Let's try this stuff. There's another hole, so careful. Yeah, Ooh. I like that a lot. I'm I'm just here for the really awkward like sewer lid as part of the handle. Like, I don't know what it actually so the is. So big gears. Is what it well, is. yeah, it looks like a buzzsaw blade, actually. It, yeah, it's like yeah. But it's big and like big, big, like Yoshi. Yes, like a big Yoshi. Big, big Yoshi. Which only happens if you beat him enough Yoshi cookies. That's true. <clears throat> That's how I became a big Yoshi. I ate a lot of Yoshi cookies. Oh, really? Yeah. Sounds like it took a lot of work. It didn't really. It's surprisingly <laughs> easy to become big eating Yoshi cookies. <laughs> okay, so it is possible to see where those are. Yeah. All right. I just need to pay attention. All right. 
Yeah. What are these weird looking like coiled things on the ground? Coiled things? Coiled, yes. All coiled up. You're like knotted up and. Yeah, it looks like it's what fell from those things. It does like a weird splash around them. They're gross. Alright, I'm really curious. What? Okay, so that fatal charge. Wish. Wish. <laughs> wish stone cube. Recover wish stone. Temporarily really restores HP. Recovery wish stone, yeah. Uh, is, oh, it's a consumable item? The cube is the, the wondrous physic. Oh, right. I forgot about that. Yeah, I actually should probably equip, equip it. that. Yeah. yeah. So I can use it when I need it. That's yeah. right. So okay. I can swap that makes it more out sense. and recover HP. So. Yeah, now, that, now that you've said that, I remember us talking about it being like the wondrous physic. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, so that's probably what that ability was talking about, I guess. Oh. Charges faster. Oh yeah. There's another one of those. Cool. We gotta we gotta find an elevator. This is why the cathedral was built and remembered. Pilgrims worship the merciful angel. Oh mother. Press it moonstone, I like that. Wang. Wang. Alright. This is a really cool weapon. I like this weapon a lot. I don't know that I like the tiny little blade on it, but it is pretty cool. I could try it with a bigger blade on it. And see, see if I like the moves. Although I really like the other. I think it's. Hmm. Oh. You gotta be right up on her. Good grief. Wow. Takes some getting used to. Yeah, I, I think though it is good for you specifically to have a smaller weapon because of how often we end up like hitting the wall. Yeah. And like this weapon. It kicks butt, but it also sometimes gets in the way in like tighter quarters. So I think having the dagger or something akin to it has is going to prove to be really helpful. I agree. Or, or I guess maybe a spear weapon that stabs, like a, something that has a stabbing motion instead of a swinging motion. Like that. <laughs> yeah. Exactly. Well, exactly. Yes. Yeah. But like, if you want something that has a longer reach, then yeah, that's maybe true. Something that has more of a stabbing motion instead of swinging. Yeah, I wonder. If you put the longer blade that I have on there, it would become basically a spear, which is kind of interesting. Uh, uh, yeah, so it, because the handle determines the move set, right? Mm -hmm. Which is why, like the saber is much more like slashing, and and like the dagger handle was stabby. Right. So. I hear you. I don't. Ooh, good block. I don't recall what decay does i think it's like specifically i think it's poison i think okay there's probably a description of it somewhere Ow. <laughs> Ew. all right that's getting dealt with right now right. get out of you here piece of arcs trash <laughs> oh my yeah now we're gonna find out what it does yeah it's just poison okay well that's that's good could be worse Is that an at yeah, it's an attribute. Good. Actually, while we're at it. Huh. Okay, that was cool. That is I like really how cool. that looked. Oh, it's it's a slow regenerative. Huh. Well, that's okay. Yeah. Interesting. Yeah, I'm all right with that. That's pretty cool. Because that was one of my gripes with like the starting uh, crystal tier and the wondrous physic is it's like it's just a HP heal that's very generic. Yeah. Um, and this is a little different. It's uh, it adds a dimension to the healing, which is cool. All right. Yeah. There's nowhere to go over there. I'm just gonna go up here. Yep. Oh, hey, buddy. Oh, he looks fun. Get the big sword out for this guy. Ooh. <clears throat> oh, 
Oh. I didn't do that perfectly, but that was very fun. <laughs> <laughs> that gave me a little bit of Sekiro vibe there, where you gotta deflect a bunch of times. <clears throat> Overgrown. That's cool looking. Listen, who's playing the organ? Can you pick a different song? Nope. You're being very dreary right now. This is a dreary chapel. We must continue to feel. I don't know. <laughs> I don't know either. Blech. Hey, wait, here's up the steps. Huh? Yeah, well, that's the elevator that will take in a minute. Go up those steps. Okay. I saw an item that way. Oh, hey. I'm not gonna lie, he legit caught me by surprise and scared me. That was startling. Yeah, he made my jump. Made my jump. Made my jump. There too. Uh huh. Excuse me. Hmm. Oh. Oh. You go across. Just sort of. Kinda. Yeah, it's like partially cave it in. Cave it in. Yep. Hey. Cecile is unwell again. Today, Brother Adam found her standing like one of the dead at the edge of the cliff of Butterback. If it's a mild sleepwalking, it's fine, but I'm worried it's her old blood compulsiveness again. Mm. I know about her strong beliefs better than anyone else, so it's really too bad. God will be glad with uh, the atoned. Perhaps I should ask her for atonement for visiting the Isle of Alchemists. I have their relic in my hand, thanks to Cecile. I won't let those bastards ruin the crotch anymore. This will purify the city. Maybe it was a mistake to accept those guys from the beginning. This disaster was divine judgment. They should have been turned away all those 30 years ago. This will be the end. Rot is a city blessed by God, and I, Andreas, will come to its rescue. The journal is badly torn. Why me? Mm. Ah, yes, the hubris of man. Fine. How about? How about? How about no? How about, how about I die? Yeah. All right, right then. Like an endless combo. Okay. <laughs> how about? How, how about? How about I just lay down? And how about I just die then? Yeah. Why not you just die? Let's go ahead and head back here. Oh, pressure plate. Nice. Shooter in the in the jeans. Oh yeah. What? What? Wow. Excuse me, sir. Sir. Wait your turn. Get with you in a minute. Mm hmm. Gotta read you. Gotta. Gotta charge the juice. Yep. Uh... Missed the cartridges there. To your oh. left. Down on left one. Yeah. Magazine. There we go. I wish it, like, fired off correctly the first time. Yeah. Thanks. First two times really first time it works every time all right that's right how did you know <laughs> ah. here here <laughs> interesting just smack her with the blunt of the blade yeah I, i'm wondering if that did a a guard oh no 
Didn't that time. Will you? Okay. Hmm. Definitely like the stabbing animation more. Hmm. But it might be cool to like stab, stab, and then put that in there, you know? Right. Ba, 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 ba. And there's also the uh, the whirling move too. Yes. Be prepared for this time. Yeah, where's the big guy in here? Oh, that still needs recharging. Interesting. Huh. Cube. Maybe it's just a time limit thing? Maybe. Is the big guy not in here anymore? I uh, you killed him, so I guess not. Yeah, I guess he doesn't respawn. Mm. Up the stairs we go. Forgot about him already. You again. Cool. Foiled again. <laughs> Hey, can you back. go down that side? Hold on. Like, I know we got stuff to explore over there. It just... It looks like a door in the middle of the bridge. Take that. Yeah, I'll check that out. Uh oh. Okay. Okay, we got some stuff in here. Ooh, the holy mark. Is that a... Oh, I've got a third ambulance slot I'm not using. Uh, I think consumption durability. Although I, I mm. haven't really had problems with it. Could do max HP. Yeah, nice. Let's do HP. It's very nice. So you, you got the Archbishop's Holy Bar? Yes. Nice. Literally just picked that up. Uh, is it over here? Yeah. Oh, okay. Yeah. Um, we actually need to go take that elevator before we explore too much further. Okay. Because it looks like the elevator will take us up to a person to get a thing. Ooh. Uh, Union strengthening frame. Yep, just straight upgrade. Nice. A little heavier, but I'm already slightly heavy, so. That item is pissing me off. <laughs> you can drop down to that yeah. pretty easily, actually. Yeah. Okay, yeah, I think you can drop down that kiln there, but you're saying go down and take the elevator first, right? Yeah, I'm saying go across take the elevator first, yeah. Okay. Let's let's knock that out real quick. Okay. Yep. There you go. All right. Yep. Where? Up that elevator right there. To your right. Right there. Ah. Right down the road. Right down the road. All right, we're going to talk to an NPC. You will give be given options. Mm-hmm. Uh, one of the options will get you a fire abrasive, which is kind of handy. Oh, yeah. The other option, the option, Damn it. the other. I can't find a way out. Monsters everywhere. I need to grab my share and leave. The other oh. option. The other option um, would be applied to the free from puppet strings ending. Okay. But we will not be able to get that because we've already broken that that line. So. All right. Well, I guess tell me which one gives me the fire abrasive then. 
I'm gonna get to it. Vanini works is what you want. Okay. Hey, doggo. Dude, look at his weapons. Yeah. Uh, Halberd. Uh, what are you, Gilgamesh? That's that's cool. He's got. I want that sword. That's cool looking. <laughs> it is cool looking. I think that Lucian hammer is dangerous looking too. Oh, that's odd. Yeah. I thought I was the only one with a sound mind here. I'm sure, I don't need to introduce myself. Note these golden wings. Yes, you guessed it. Mm. You don't know who I am. Preposterous! Everyone in Kraut has heard of me. Do you live under a rock? Yep. I'm Alidoro the Hound. Treasure hunter extraordinaire. Yes. He's got yes, some solar energy. I ditched my real name in the past. <laughs> I'm looking for other survivors of this disaster, but it's uh, been a lonely search, and there's danger around every corner. Do you know of a place where I can take refuge? Preferably someplace clean and comfortable, you know, civilized. Name. Know him, Vanini Works. Vanini Works, okay. Vanini Works? I didn't give that place much thought. That's where the puppets are being made, after all. Hmm. But I heard tell of a shelter there as well. With no first-hand knowledge, I suppose I have to trust you. I have a lot of searching ahead of me, so why don't I lighten my load? Consider this an act of charity. A thank you gift. Take it. Benini Works doesn't strike me as particularly safe. <laughs> uh, it's safer now that you've cleared out the big bad fuego. Yeah. It's not really civilized, though, right? Right. <laughs> well, Since okay, so this helpful, is why... I'll give you a peek at my collection. Show me what you're worthy of. This is the real thing that we wanted to talk to him about. Go for it. Talk. Let me see what he has. Hold on. Yeah. Ooh. He's got the weapons. Ooh, one, okay. Or at least one of them. That's, um, yeah. But more importantly, he also has... Oh, those are your boss weapons, by the way. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Etiquette. <laughs> King's, King's flame. flame. Okay. Holy sword. Oh, of that's the, the arc. sword that you um, this that the summoner was using. Yeah, and the, something that's similar. Yeah, and the first summon was using etiquette. Ah, oh, that's actually interesting. Mm -hmm. The recommendation here is to grab the extreme modification amulet which will provide you a significant damage boost as long as you have at least four Fable Charges. Fascinating. But I can't get etiquette. Okay, yeah. What, what, what will all these do? Let's see. Perfect Guard, temporarily increased damage inflicted by weapon attack. That's cool. Proportion to number of Fable slots. Dodging even with low stamina. Interesting. Let's see. Aww. This is a great sword. High motivity. Seven, seven, yeah, these are all of the same type as the halberd. Seven explosions. It's like the seven paths. Guard yeah. carry, okay. Etiquette, single stab. Perfect block. Fascinating. It's a pretty cool weapon. Yeah. Holy Sword of the Ark. Hold down the attack button. Activate. Okay, yeah. Transform the length of the handle. What? So, oh, that's what Alter does. Yeah. It's like a trick weapon or something. Great sword and a glaive. You can change it into a glaive. Oh. That's just too cool. <laughs> yeah, that's, that's pretty neat. That's pretty neat. Yes, how neat is that? Man, that sucks because it recommends that, but that is a really high technique weapon. <laughs> Listen, you do what you want. It's just that the, the damage output from that amulet is pretty good, is why it was suggested. Yeah, and I'm, I'm already set up pretty well, so I will grab this amulet, but I've got my eye on that for maybe a future playthrough of this game. Maybe New Game Plus? Yeah, could do it in a New Game Plus, yeah. But yeah, I'm I'm gonna grab this. This this looks like a really good amulet. Um, and then I'm real curious about this thing. And that is a nice amulet, but it's a little more situational than that one was. Right. So I think I could justify grabbing this. And Got some Lance of Longinus energy. Yeah. 
I, I gotta grab the seven path sword. It's just so cool looking. Yeah, I'm, I want to see seven explosions. Yeah. <clears throat> okay, yeah. What else you got for me? About the collection. As a descendant of aristocrats, the very best families, I have a duty to the common people. I live my life fulfilling that duty. And part of that duty is ensuring these items are returned to their rightful owners. Mm -hmm. What I'm showing you is just a portion of the collection. If you come to the refuge, we'll be able to continue our confabulation. Oh, thanks. Until then, remember this hound when golden wings shine. Hmm. <laughs> so, uh, just kind of harking back on telling him Vanini works over, like, Krat Hotel, right? Yeah. yeah. Mm -hmm. Um... Geppetto warned us about the stalkers. Right. And he was just like, hey, if you're going to let people know about this safe haven, that is a huge sword. Yeah, it's massive. All right, I got to. Nope. <laughs> oh, that's cool. Wow. But, but anyway, Geppetto was like, hey, be careful telling who you tell. This is the last St. David at Krat. Right. So I think telling them that the mini works as a safe space is the safer option. Uh, right? okay. Because what if they go crazy? Why is your blade red? Yeah, you seem to get a buff whenever you alter it. So... Stamina consumption is reduced temporarily. Ah. Uh, so I'm kind of burning some of this, but then if I look at it here, does it change it? Yeah. I think you get an attack buff after you transform it again. I see. Man, that's a cool weapon. <clears throat> All right. Let's look at the other. I'm curious about this one, too. Okay. Hang on. Okay, I can't trigger seven explosions right now, but I'm assuming those other blades pop out when you do that. Yeah, that's so. That's a. I was not expecting a slamming move set from that. Whoa. Ooh. Whoa. Oh. Spin to win. <laughs> I quite like that sword. That's pretty cool. Eh, it's not bad. I mean, I probably if I'm gonna use one of these, I should get some more motivity. But that might be the motivation I need to move toward a more quality type build. Um, sure. For now, we're gonna probably stick with what I've got since they're upgraded. But those are awesome, and I'm definitely gonna be intrigued to see what etiquette does. Yeah. Um. All right. All right we'll go ahead and head back down. And I guess he'll be at Vanini Works after we kill another boss. We can see what else he's got. Sure. There's your boss weapon guy. Yeah, you got boss weapons. All right, so we need to... We, we opened the safe and picked up the Workshop Union Strengthening Flame, right? Uh, the what? what was this? Workshop Union Strengthening Frame? Oh, yeah, 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 right there. Yeah. Cool. Uh, all right, so we need to push the burning kiln into the decay. No problem. Jeez. I think once we once we push the kiln in, we'll be able to clear up a whole bunch of stuff. Yeah. All right. <laughs> it's kind of a cool mechanic. Okay. Ah, stargazer. Oh, that's back where we were too. Yeah. Is there a? Uh... This I guess item. there's no shortcut to get back. That's fine. Go nope. ahead and talk to Cecile since we're here. Uh, okay, I was going to check. Hold on one second. Ladder. Yeah, but does that... 
get us back to that room. I don't think it does. Yeah, it seems to go somewhere else. There's no oh, wait. Top. Actually, actually, go down the ladder. I bet it opens that door. Oh, yeah, you're probably right. Okay. Yep. I think, I think I am. Let me get that item, too. Yep. Can we open this door? Are you kidding me? Oh, there we go. Yeah, this will do it. Wow, Dang. that made me instinctively want to, like, cover my fingers there. Okay. Okay, that's yep, boss. Nice. Yep. So we'll want to um, talk to Cecile before we do the boss. Yeah, I'm going to look at this. And sing praise for a new saint has arrived. I, Saint Andreas, will consecrate the land. That's got to be Saint Andreas through that door. <laughs> yes. That's probably. Got to be who that is. Okay, yeah, then this is... All right. This all connects together. It's it's nice. It's nice. All right. Cecile. Oh, thank you. Just seeing the Archbishop's holy mark renews my spirit. It's a reminder of the quiet power of faith. I'll remember this forever, Stalker. Oh, is that what you think I am? <laughs> it's a reminder of the quiet. Okay. Got a resistance ampule from her. Yep. And we should be we're probably close on time at this point. Yeah. We we are indeed close on time. I think uh, we will tackle the boss next time. Um, I'm going to teleport back to Hotel Krat here. Yeah, good idea. But yeah, we all we got left is the, the boss for this chapter. All right. And then we'll and then we'll have some housekeeping to do with uh, Cecile mm. and um, Al oh, Aladoro. Oh yeah, Aladoro. Yep. Who we just met. All right, let's start evening it out. I can already tell I'm gonna want to use at least one of those new weapons, so. Might as well yeah. even out the motivity technique spread. I guess advance. Well, you can probably mm -hmm. test the uh, the weapon in here too with the the targeting dummy. Oh yeah, you're right. Let's do it. Because it refills the while you're out here. Yeah, there it goes. Yeah, yeah. It's just <clears throat> let's mess with this a little bit. <laughs> wow. Good bit of damage there. Does it do the same attack with the extended handle? Yeah, let's find that out. Yeah, so with the extended... Yeah, that's so the blade's special probably the same too. Yeah. That is cool. That's that's more like the linked slash. That's a multi hit. Yeah. Alright. <clears throat> and then this guy. Alright. Oh, that was awesome. Okay. Yep. Oh, that's um. Oh, okay. Like a perfect guard. Yeah. Uh... I quite like this sword. <laughs> and that's the LB and Y, right? That you did that with? Yeah, that's right. It's that move right there. Yeah. Okay. That gives you a big window for perfect guard, which is kind of nice. And that is a cool move. And that seems yeah. like posture break pretty much immediately. Yeah. Fascinating. 
All right, cool. Very, very good. Got some new weapons. Met some new people. Way. Yeah. Got a new arm that can shoot bullets. Now you're Mega Man. Pretty much. Yeah. <laughs> I'm liking the I'm liking the new arm. It's pretty pretty good. It's certainly helpful in this area with a bunch of people who just knock you off. Tiny. Yes, we've also learned that rafters are indeed a much more challenging boss than rooftops. <laughs> Yeah, I am not surprised by that. <laughs> Remember the loft? No! Wow. Oh. <laughs> Seeing him grab the blade is very unnerving. Yeah, it is. I don't know how that's supposed to work. That is a powerful combo. <laughs> Very interesting. Yeah, I'll probably goof with that a little bit more off screen before uh, we continue on our next episode. Yeah. Definitely gotten more heavy from equipping big sword, so we will make some calls on build and everything. Um, yeah. But yeah, yeah, thanks so much, everybody, for joining us. Uh, again, next time we will be fighting the boss of uh, the cathedral there. So um, yeah, definitely join us for that. It should be wacky fun as you watch me die repeatedly. <laughs> <sighs> so wacky, so whimsical. Or beat it the first time, who knows? <laughs> oh, yeah, right. <laughs> uh, yeah, Archbishop Andreas, I believe, is who we think we're... we're and yeah, St. Andreas seems like who we're going to fight, so we'll find out. Yeah, yeah for sure. Uh, but in the meantime, if you like what you watch, please do the thing with the buttons like the bell and the subscribe and the like and the comments and all of that helps us out tremendously as we're trying to grow our channel. We would love to have more people join. You know, we want to be able to provide more for you, but to do that, we have to be able to free up other time which means we gotta be able to monetize which means we gotta get more people to follow so chain of events required before we can make some progress uh so yeah share like subscribe all that will help uh check out our other series as well we've got plenty that i'm sure you'll find that you'll enjoy whether it's our long-running series with persona and Xeno Gears and Skies, or if it's something more chill and cozy like our Coffee Talk Tea Time episodes, or Little Kitty Big Cities, what we got going on right now, which has been a real treat. And loving all the hats and the cute encounters with the different animals, definitely worth a watch. As well as our other series. So, yeah, we got plenty to watch, plenty of games to check out, and lots of giggles and laughs and just silly antics along the way. Yes, indeed. All of those things. And uh, yeah, we have a blast playing these games. If you want to see any other Soulsborne games, um, you know, we play those. We do have multiplayer series. It's either starting or has already started uh, with Salt and Sanctuary. But there's the potential for doing some co-op games, which you get to watch us suffer together. It would be great. Um, right. <laughs> and uh, yeah, thanks so much uh, for watching uh, hope you're enjoying the playthrough, and uh, we'll be back next time with the boss fight. That's right. Thank you so much for being here. We hope you have a wonderful day, and we'll catch you all in the next video. See you next time. Bye bye now. Diddly diddly do 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 do. Thanks for watching.